This is Dr. Daniel Paul with Easy Orthopedics, and today we're going to talk about what happens if you don't treat carpal tunnel syndrome and you just let it go. The short answer is that if it gets bad, you can end up with nerve damage in your hand and constant numbness and tingling. Um, but this isn't always the case. It just depends on how bad your carpal tunnel syndrome is. So what is carpal tunnel syndrome? It just means that there's a nerve in your hand. It kind of goes through right here, and it provides uh, some motor muscles to your thumb and other muscles and uh, sensation to these first three fingers and half of your ring finger. Now, that nerve is in a tight space, and usually when people sleep at night, they do this. It pushes on that nerve, and then they get tingling. That's why a lot of people with carpal tunnel syndrome will get tingling at night, or we call it night pain. It's because a lot of people sleep like this, and um, it irritates the nerve. Um, so, carpal tunnel syndrome is graded into three different uh, types, mild, moderate, and severe. You can only determine if it's mild, moderate, or severe based on nerve conduction studies. Albeit, if someone has really severe disease, you can tell on physical exam as well. If you have mild disease, you, you can usually get rid of it through a combination of wearing splints at night and some nerve gliding exercises, plus, plus or minus a steroid injection, which is not always needed, but sometimes it helps. If you have moderate carpal tunnel syndrome, again, this is based on a nerve conduction studies where they put a bunch of needles in your arm and they determine how bad the nerve is uh, compressed. If you have moderate carpal tunnel syndrome, usually, eventually, you'll probably need surgery, but if you try those treatment methods, you may do all right. Um, if you have severe uh, carpal tunnel syndrome, it means that the nerve is really suffering, and then if you, that's when you just essentially need to get surgery done. Usually, it's not like you need to do it the next day, but you don't, it's something you don't want to put off for uh, you know months and months. You want to get it done sooner rather than later. If you don't do that and you just let it go, basically, it'll end up deadening the nerve, the median nerve, uh, as it enters the carpal tunnel, which will result in constant numbness and tingling, and something we call thenar uh, atrophy. The thenar muscles are just the muscles right in your thumb here, so these will start to get really soft. And then even after you do the surgery, you'll still be left with like, uh, you know, loss of muscle or muscle atrophy and numbness and tingling. So the short story is, if you have mild carpal tunnel and you just leave it alone and it doesn't get worse, nothing bad is going to happen. But if you let it go for years and years and it becomes severe, then you can end up with permanent nerve damage. Um, so I hope I was able to answer your questions. If you have any questions about carpal tunnel syndrome in general, feel free to leave a comment below. If you like this video, we put out new content every Friday. So please like and subscribe and thanks for watching.